In the last video, we were in Meteora, exploring all of the beautiful monasteries there were to see. When planning our trip to Greece, we really wanted to explore places that you've never really heard about. So we made sure to skip out on places like Mykonos, Santorini, Crete, and other hotspots like that. After exploring different locations, islands, and beaches, we came across Lefkada, a small coastal town that doesn't have much information on, nor that many informative videos about the place. So we agreed this would be a great spot. And there we went on a four hour drive from Meteora to somewhere we didn't even know much about or if it would be anything worth visiting. This is Lefkada. Good morning from maybe the most beautiful Airbnb we have ever stayed at here in Lefkada, Greece. I mean, look at the place behind us. We have a, our own pool. Felipe's room is up there with Kelly. Our room is under his and hers. Breakfast room, we have a kitchen and a whole living room there. But look at this insane sunrise. Crazy. We relaxed for a bit and watched the sun rise over the beautiful ocean from our Airbnb. But look at our Airbnb, this is, this is incredible. Kelly's room, Kat's and Ira's room. This entire place is ours. Private pool and a view off until the islands. Oh, I'll give you a full tour now. I know it's gonna be a little dirty, but look. This is our bedroom right here. Got our closet situation here. We have, you know, the desk, whatever. Not a desk. Stand, our incredible view. Let's check out this bathroom. Very nice. Oh, bathroom's right here. Super nice. All we need. This is our living room. You did not just show our room. Yes, I did. Every time. It's literally a mess every time. <laughs> this is how all our mornings will be starting here in Lefkada, in this beautiful Airbnb, and Kitty Cat behind me making the breakfast. <laughs> what are you making? We're making some eggs with some ham. We had trouble starting the stove, but we're back. We have a little ham and cheese sandwich. Okay. Yeah. Very yeah. nice. I do what I can to provide. <laughs> yeah. Look at where we'll be eating breakfast. This is our breakfast spot. Scheiße. The Airbnb was only $150 a night. It was such a great location and super private. We had restaurants within five minutes, but the only downside is that you need to drive everywhere as you're slightly in the mountains. So if you wanna walk everywhere, then this might not be the place for you. Besides that, this is the most beautiful Airbnb we've ever stayed at. All right, so right now we are leaving the Airbnb. It is just about 10.40 a.m. and we're going to rent a boat for the entire day. One day's rental of a boat for the four of us was $98. That is insane. We're gonna go all around the islands. As you can see behind me, there are several little islands right in front of us that we can go to. There are some bays, there are some blue caves which we can go diving in. The weather is perfect, it's sunny, it's hot, but it's also cool. The weather is just great. So let's go to the boat. We drove along the coast for about 30 minutes to where the boat was located in Sivota Bay. What's your excitement level right now, Felipe? Uh, we're at Koa Smith level. <laughs> so I'm just keeping it together because there's people around. <laughs> After meeting with Giannis, the guy who was lending us his boat, he took us aboard and gave us some quick instructions on everything we needed to know before heading out for the day. And we are officially off. Woo! Yes, sir. This day is about to be insane. Felipe, how you feeling? All right, so right now we have this boat for the next, what time is it, like 12? We have it regardless until like 6, 6.30 p.m. The total cost of this boat, which is a five meter boat, I think it's like 16 feet, is $98, which is insane. For the whole day, from nine to six, you could have it. We have a tank full of gas, a 40 horsepower engine, and he gave us a map of all the places to go, the caves, the reefs, all right, so he gave us a map and we started here in Sivota Bay. So we're gonna go all the way here. There is this island of, I think it's called Meganisi. We can go all around 
make a whole cruise. There's some cave, there's a huge cave here. Our entire boat can actually go inside. We're gonna go there, make all the way around, maybe go to Scorpio Private Island, make our way back, and we have plenty of time, plenty of fuel, and plenty of good vibes. So right now we have made our first stop in Micros Gialos Beach. It's one of the most popular beaches here in Lefkada. It's not on the other islands yet, but we are making our way there. We are just kind of going around everywhere, seeing what there is to do, stopping in some spots, snorkeling, but it is filled with adventure. There are so many things you can do, so many other beautiful sailboats. All right, we have Captain Woo! Kelly. All right, so we just got to one of the caves here and we can actually go inside of it a little bit and explore it. Let's look inside. Felipe is up now. Oh, oh. Okay, three. Two, one. Hi guys, we are here. Thoughts on the trip so far? Oh my god, we are having the best time ever! Greece is so beautiful. Lefkada is so beautiful and it is one of the most unheard of places here. Maybe you heard of it if you're from Greece or you go there a lot, but when we were researching, no one really recommends Lefkada. Top 10s, top 5s, top 3s, they were nowhere to, be, nowhere to be found. We found this place because it was going to be a stop on our journey. Yeah. But Screw Santorini, screw Mykonos, no offense. There's way better islands out there and less people and... Oh my God, and just the greatest views. Yeah. With better food, I mean. When I went to Santorini, I was fighting with people to like get a good sunset spot. Or sunrise spot, but here, we're literally waking up at our Airbnb and it's just, you, the view's right there. Can't beat it. Everyone's so nice, there's no one here. Look at this, look where we're going. <laughs> Life's good. Getting to another cave now. There are two cats here as well, two catamarans. But look at this. All right, stop number two. We're at a much bigger cave here. So I'm gonna jump in, scope out the area, and make sure that we have enough clearance to drive our boat in. We went inside the cave and just relaxed for a little. Kelly and Felipe even swam onto shore, but after some time here, we decided to head out to our final spot as it was a bit far from us and there was so much left on our adventure. So now we have made it to the other coast of Left, or not, 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 not even Lefkada, but um, Naganisi. The water is so flat here, <laughs> and we're blocked off. This island right here is blocking off all the wind, so that's why you're seeing the water be this flat as it is. Look at this. How crazy is this? I have never been happier. I mean, like just looking behind you right now is insane. It's so beautiful. What about looking at me? It's, I mean, it's the most beautiful thing. I can't compare anything to it, <laughs> so it's different. But, I mean, look at the surrounding trees. Wow. I mean, this is insane. All right, so what are your thoughts so far on the whole boating experience? This is amazing. I don't know how we're gonna top this on this <laughs> Literally. Trip. I have uh, another question. What? No, for Felipe. Oh, okay. Why is it like traveling with cat in front of It sucks. We're doing it for you, so you guys don't have to live through this. Oh my gosh, I mean. <laughs> The influencing and then the influencing. No, I'm just kidding. They're the best. 
<coughs> it has been so much fun traveling with them. They're so cool, so chill, so go with the flow. Marcos and I also planned a hell of a trip. Hell yeah. Um, and Kelly and I were not a hell of a trip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And Kelly made some, she made some nice screenshots and threw it on a power, PowerPoint for us. <laughs> that is so rude. I, I, took, I spent <laughs> like an hour and a half on my PowerPoint for this trip. And um And we spent like and 20 the reason we're here. <laughs> yeah, we spent 10 hours just with I, Chase. Yeah. I oh my god, Mama literally. Mia. <laughs> right before they asked where we want to go and I said Greece and then that's why we're we here. We should watch Mama Mia tonight. I'm down. I have to pee. Go pee. Go in the water. I know, but I can't see the floor. <laughs> and you won't see the floor. We're 18 meters out. After a quick snack break, we continued on to the next location so we could see as much as we could before returning the boat. Ah, ah, oh, 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 we have this glow, Felipe's inside. We're anchored up and it's just 5 15 p.m. Is that on my film camera? We're by. Felipe's taking some poop in the glow. You <laughs> You're pooping? Let me know if you see anything floating. You're alive. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's not. Are you kidding me? I don't know. He's at a Frank Sinatra. <laughs> I am. Nothing surprises me with Felipe. <laughs> I like but, it. Oh yeah, we're going to enjoy this <laughs> and then head back where we are going to deliver our rental. Can someone throw me goggles? I he want to looks, identify Yeah. He looks like <laughs> After a quick dive, we got back on the boat and began to head back to the bay to make it home in time for dinner. Like all good things, they must come to an end. They must come to an end for today because we are having another boat in Catalonia. But today's boating journey it has come to an end. But this boating journey has been amazing. What do you think, Kelly? It's been one of the best days of my life, for sure. <laughs> what top's this? No, this is the best day of my life. Oh, you said one of the... Oh, oh, um... The other one would be... The day she had Felipe. Oh. Yes. And when I started eating cookie dough. That was a pretty good <laughs> <laughs> Cookie, the first bite of cookie dough in your life is just, yeah. you know... It does wonders for you. <laughs> what? Now we, we rented it from. I don't know how to say that. <laughs> from this. <laughs> from so we really rented it from Ionian Ionian Charters. Ionian Charters, or if you go on Click and Boat, the link's gonna be in, in under in the description. But Click and Boat Use is discount code. Marcos can't swim. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, boo. Click and Boat is literally Airbnb but for boats. It's like Turo for cars, but for boats. It's amazing. Highly recommend it. So when you're here. If you're here, you better come here and rent a boat. Yeah. I better not, I own you. So we are now back at our Airbnb, getting ready to change, shower, and um, go to dinner. But the best part, well the craziest part really, is coming back after this insane, amazingly great day and having this as our view, as a welcome back. Like, does it get better than this? I think I've peaked in life, honestly. Look at this. We got to dinner after a long and exhausting day and listen to this fucky lacky. Oh, it just came out of here. <laughs> it's right, it's right. Fucky lacky on my face. <laughs> Lefkara is such an amazing location, and this was only day one. Make sure to subscribe so you won't miss the rest of our videos and see the crazy adventures we go on for day two and the rest of our travels all throughout Europe.